Those deadly shootings this weekend and the rise in gun violence across Portland. Our Lindsay Nadrich here asking tough questions of Portland's mayor today as many want justice and accountability. Lindsay, what did you find out after talking with Mayor Wheeler, who's also the police commissioner? Well, we saw an unprecedented number of shootings in Portland last year, and law enforcement says we're already on pace to easily surpass that level this year. It's brought a lot of fear in the community and raises questions about what's being done to stop the violence. This was a deadly, difficult, and disturbing weekend for our city. At a press conference today, we heard from Portland Mayor Ted Wheeler, the FBI, the U.S. Attorney for Oregon, the police chief, and the Multnomah County District Attorney, who say they're all working together to seek justice and find solutions. When asked why we're just hearing from them now, we were told they were waiting to be able to provide more accurate and solid information to the public. I hear the anger and the frustration, and maybe more than anything else, the fear that people are expressing and they need to know that their mayor takes this seriously, that I am prioritizing it. People directly impacted by the violence tell me they're fearful and want answers. Some even telling me they're ready to leave Portland if things don't change fast. They want to know where the leadership is because they feel like they're not getting it. And I'm not just talking about this one incident. It's a long list of incidents and every time people are asking where's the leadership in this. I don't know how anyone in this community could hear about or read about or in some cases personally experience the kind of horrific violence we've seen this weekend and feel anything other than other, dis other despair and a profound sense of sadness. But for me, what this does is it motivates me and it underscores the importance of the direction and the investments that my administration has been making. Mayor Wheeler says this is why they created the Enhanced Community Safety Team and the Focused Intervention Team to respond to and investigate gun violence. He also said they're working to retain police officers and told us they've set a goal to hire 300 police staff over the next three years to get closer to minimum staffing levels in the police bureau. Mayor Wheeler says they've also invested in community groups that work to break the cycle of violence and will continue to do that. And that's what I've been doing all weekend, is working with people who will work with me to move towards a Portland where people don't have to look over their backs anymore. Finally, the mayor said the city council is now unified in their urgency and desire to reduce gun violence, something he says changed from a year ago when he was the only one to vote in favor of funding the focused intervention team. Reporting live, I'm Lindsay Natterich, Coin 6 News. Yes.